Hello guys and welcome to new UDK tutorial. Today I want to show you how to make multiply bots so that you have two or three or four kind of bots. So first of all you have to create your own bot. For example you can make a animal or something else. I have done this here. I went into the characters, there I choose slime and put on another material so that it shines a little bit and yeah that's it. Now go to UDK, Development, SRC, UT Game, Classes. There you have to search for UT Family Info Leandry and UT Family Info Leandry Mail. This two here. And now copy and paste them. Okay. Now rename them to whatever you like. So UT Family Info, I say test. And the UT Family Info Leandry Mail copy. You have, to choose, you have to rename it to UT Family Info, your name, in my case, test and mail. So now we have UT Family Info test and UT Family Info test mail. Now double click onto your UT, fam UT Family Info test. There you have to rename the class. So UT Family Info test. Test, whoop, wrong. Test extends UT Family Info. At family ID you have to choose any ID you want, so I choose PC and at fraction you can also choose any name you want. I choose Metal. Now go into UDK, right click onto the skeletal, copy full name to clipboard and you have to add it here. Correct the mesh, add your mesh. Ok, save. Now make a double click onto the UT family info test mail. There you have to rename UT Family Info Test or your name. Mail extends UT Family Info Test. Okay, UT Family Info Test Mail extends UT Family Info Test. At Family ID you have to add your ID. In my case it was PC. And at the correct mesh, right click on to the skeletal, copy full name to clipboard and add it at character mesh. And save. Ok, now we can close that. And yeah, now we have to search for UT char info. So UT, 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 UT char info. Scroll down. And here at default properties, copy the family, families add class UT blah blah blah. And paste it. Now rename it to your name. So UT family info test mail. Families add class UT family info test mail. Save. Now go to UDK game, config, and here double click onto the default char info. Okay, here you have to rename this here to your name. In my case it was, it was test. And you can also rename this here to test2. And you can, yeah, you can leave the first one and save. Okay, now here at fraction you have to choose your fraction. Yeah, in my case it was metal. So type in metal. Copy this and rename everything here to metal. This here and this here. This here and this. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. I hate editor. But yeah. Okay. Now go to the end and here at family ID you have to put in your family. In my case it was, it was PC. Uh, so PC. 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 Okay. Now save it and open UDK. So, uh, no binaries. And open it. UDK left. Open. Yes. Now script outdated. Yes, we really would like to rebuild. And hopefully we don't get any errors, but I hope not. Yeah. And just warnings. That's good. Okay. And open it again. Yes. 
Okay, now instant action, game mode, deathmatch, map, deck, settings, Nawis, 16, and back, and start game. And yeah, hopefully it has worked. So let's see. 3, 2, 1, 0. And now you see, there is our shining bot. And probably we'll find a normal bot. Um, shining, shining, shining. Shining. Shining, shining. Uh, where are the normal bots? And here's the normal bot. Yeah, this was the normal one, and these are mines here. And yeah, when you want to control the number of some bots, so for example that the shining bots aren't so many, you have to go into UDK game, config, default charming bot. Here you have to add, for example, yeah, delete this test away and type in Leandry 2 and then you have more normal Leandris than ours. Yeah, that's how to add a multiply bot and hopefully it has worked and we will see us again later.